Alright, I'm back guys and how you doing YT? So, just uh, want to do another quick upload about, uh, this time it's about bicycle belts. Uh, I think you can also use this for uh, electric scooters or Evo scooters. So this is a cat eye cycling bell. Now, uh, I think this is the Chinese or China version. I'm gonna try and look for <coughs> uh, there should be something like made in I think Japan or China. Uh, just can't really see them. It's not over here. Uh, nope. It doesn't really say so, but on the plastic, when I remove this one, uh, it says made in China. So, one second. Uh, this one, okay. So, this might be a uh, uh, cat eye. A bell or bicycle bell that is made in China. They also have one made in Japan. I think that's, that's the original one. Not sure if this is copy or. But uh, here, there you go. Uh, I'm gonna try focus it. So they have Japan and uh, what else? America, Cavite? No. <laughs> Anyway, as long as this one works, I'm, I'm A-OK with it. So, they do have different colors. Green, black. I think this one is pink. Dark pink. And a little bit of violet. Orange. And uh, I'm going to try do a simple sound check. And then later on, I'm going to use an Android phone and download and install a decibel meter. So this one we're going to check without the decibel meter. Okay, uh, here we go. Once again. So if ever you're trying to click this and there's no sound, the easiest way to troubleshoot is just you pull the bell over here. Pull it out there, and then just install it back uh, uh, slowly. And then try to ring it once again, and you can try to push it way much harder and see what will happen. Kind of click it. There you go. So if you, I think, if you install this like. Uh, if it's not pushed all the way like so I think it won't ring but I'm gonna try it there right it's not yet pushed all the way down so let's go and push it slowly and then I'm gonna try it one more time there you go so normally we we sell this kind of bells with the packaging like so but the batch or the stocks that I got right now, they, they don't have this anymore. It's just the bell and the plastic. I'm not sure, maybe because of the pandemic. Alright, so I'm um, going to open up. Uh, I think I've downloaded a decibel meter. Okay, so right now the um, we're going to reset it first. Okay, so max is 56, 59. I'm gonna put this over here. I'm gonna try out the bell and see if we're gonna get a reaction. So maximum was 69. So let's go and try this out. One more time. And another one, same location, okay. 
So at this time the maximum decibel reading is at 84 dB. So a while ago it was only at 69 when we're not clicking the bell. So I think that's the loudest that it can uh, produce or do. So uh, pricing, uh, I think it is at two dollars or a hundred and twenty pesos. So two dollars and uh, thirty cents, something like that. Okay, so I think we also have different colors, but. So far, this is all I have at the moment. I think we used to have like blue, uh, red, but this one is pink. Now, for you to install this on your uh, mountain bike or a uh, handlebar, you need to loosen this one with the Phillips screw. And then if your handlebar or if your bike does have a hand grip you need to remove it and then uh, slowly uh, install it on on this side of course this one goes to the I believe uh, left I think you cannot install it on the right because you cannot push it here so this one goes to the left uh, handlebar so you can do it like so oops I just don't have a handlebar uh, to test it okay some sometimes they remove the screw all the way and then they try to to bend it but that's uh, I'm gonna try and show you now okay give me a second Where's my Phillips screw this is my Phillips screw so sometimes they do a shortcut they remove the bolt or the the screw like so and they don't want to remove the hand grips they're just going to stretch this out like so but that's the uh, wrong way of installing it you might break the clamp so uh, I don't recommend doing that so much better remove the bolt remove the handle grip and then slide this on the handlebar then use a rubber or a tape to uh, to secure the insulation of the bell. Okay, doc. So I think that's all I can uh, share to you at the moment about this bell. So if you need the uh, cat eye simple bell, you can click on the link. Uh, in the comment section or the video description by the way the model of this one is uh, P PB 1000 AL or P8 uh, I'm not really sure PB or P8 1000 so that's all for now see you tomorrow